I received a very interesting question concerning the Holy Spirit. Here it is. Are we born with the Holy Spirit who is activated when we believe? How does that work? Well, it's always good to ask questions about how the Holy Spirit is working in our lives. It would not be quite accurate to say that the Holy Spirit is activated when we believe, but it would be accurate to say that the Holy Spirit is very, very active before we come to believe, during the believing process, and everything that happens after that. The scriptures tell us that one of the things that the Holy Spirit does is convict us of our sin. Now this happens before we come to faith. In fact, when the Holy Spirit begins to convict us of our sin, he begins to show us uh, how, what it means to be separated from God. And he, it also uh, serves to show us the truth of our own conviction that we may not have been aware of until we came under conviction of sin. So the, this is a, a very, very, very important work of the Holy Spirit where the Holy Spirit begins to work in our lives and shows the sinfulness of sin and uh, the reality of our separation from God. That's the work of the Holy Spirit. Se secondly, the Holy Spirit is, is the one who reveals truth to us. Uh, the Apostle Paul, uh, writing to the Corinthians, talked about certain spiritual truths that are only spiritually discerned. That means they're only discerned through the work of the Holy Spirit. So not only is the Holy Spirit convicting us of sin, but he is revealing to us the reality of Jesus. It's possible for us to live uh, a long time without any active, vital knowledge uh, of who Jesus really is. It's possible for us to have some vague idea that there is a God, but with, with little or no knowledge of his character or his purposes, his promises, his warnings, and his, his plan for our lives. But when the Holy Spirit starts working in our lives, he begins to reveal these things to us and they become spiritually discerned. So the Holy Spirit is active in convicting us of sin. The Holy Spirit is active in revealing truth to us. I believe also that the Holy Spirit works in our spirits and as scripture puts it, draws us to God. For Jesus said, no one comes to the Father except the Father draw him or through the work of the Holy Spirit. There is that compelling desire to discover the reality of Christ and to uh, have that sense of forgiveness of sins and reconciliation with God. This is the work of the Holy Spirit, drawing us to Him. And when we yield to this, then the Spirit of God really begins to work in our lives in re beginning to reshape us. And this is so dramatic uh, that the scripture calls it being born again of the Spirit. And when we're born again of the Spirit, what that means is that we enter into a new relationship where instead of being rebellious against God, we become children of God. We are born into his family. Not only are we born into his family, when the Holy Spirit comes into our lives, he brings to us the life of Jesus himself. And we begin to live in the power of his resurrection through the Holy Spirit. And we embark on a life of discipleship. And discipleship is simply a human being living in union with the indwelling Holy Spirit, drawing upon his power and grace and living in obedience to what he says and uh, claiming the promises that he makes. So, so there you are, there's a quick answer to how the Holy Spirit works in our lives when we come to faith and what happens afterwards. And thank you for asking that question.